I'm Robert Dudzik and welcome you to a new series of my new videos of what I just call what I use and how I use. In these videos I want to address so many of the questions that I received from you over the months since I released my first video regarding what gear I'm using, which software, which plugins. So I hope these videos will help you understand what's going on. We will talk about my software, my plugins, my microphones, my recordings gear, my setup, it's basically everything what's going on under the hood to get to the sounds what I'm getting right now. So today I want to talk about you, about brand new instrument I just received two weeks ago from the native instrument and it's called Trill. Trill is a sound escape building tension tool instrument what's run inside the contact. And it's very simple to operate. All you get to know, just hit one key and play your mouse over the X, Y, Z part. And this is what's happening. Just take a look. So, what I did, put like one of the patches and I hit my key and move my mouse. And this is what's happening. Of course, you don't have to use mouse. You can program this by adding animations to your track and you can get crazy effects. You can go really precision and do all stuff. But if you want to get the human feeling, I would strongly recommend you use mouse because it's just how you feel, you know? You're not gonna be perfect, but it's gonna sound like human. Another way how I can use Trill will be by adding additional contact instrument, but this time I'm gonna add my personal samples when I record my hits, trailer hits, lock these channels together and get amazing sound. So look at this, what's happening. This is just the one sound. One of my hits when I listen. But look what's happened if I'm gonna lock this thing together with trill and the same sound. Pretty cool how you see like building tension, sound escape. It's it just completely changed my sound. I, I'm so excited. And before we're gonna finish, I wanna show you one more cool thing. I just received in the mail a couple of weeks ago, Expressive Touche MIDI controller. It's like a touch sensitive, I don't know how to explain this thing, but it's, it's really cool what it does. Just take a listen. Basically, I program my XYZ part to the Touche and it's changing my expression. Instead of hitting the mouse, I just put my hand over and by playing, I can change my motions, control the sound. So take a listen. So it's pretty cool. It'll be hard to do this over the mouse. And of course you can do this by programming, but then you quantize it and, and it's, it doesn't gonna sound like human. It sounds more like a machine by adding your personal motion touch. It's pretty sensitive. You add the human feel and your sounds become just more live. So that will be end for my first video today for you. So I hope you enjoy and I hope I see you in the next one.